The Notorious Landlady was the last film Kim Novak made with director Richard Quine. The actress had starred in three other Quine films throughout her career. In 1954, Quine directed Novak, then a fresh face in her first major role in Pushover. Then in 1958, she appeared with Jimmy Stewart in Quine's romantic comedy, Bell, Book, and Candle, which we showed earlier tonight. And Novak co-starred with Kirk Douglas in Quine's 1960 melodrama, Strangers When We Meet. They also fell in love and were engaged for a time in the mid-1960s. Up next, Novak stars again with her notorious landlady leading man, Jack Lemmon. It's another comedy, also starring Judy Holliday and Jack Carson. Tonight on Turner Classic Movies, Star of the Month Kim Novak is the rebound for Jack Lemmon in Then Cary Grant and Irene Dunn discover the awful truth. And Grant is a ghostly helper in Topper 